this is Christy again uh, this time with a voiceover I'm so happy that I'm back with studio vlogs it's been a good eight months at least um, I've been really busy with working full-time and just life in general but I'd love to run you through the ins and outs of a part-time small business owner and also a mom which takes a huge toll on the time that I have available for the nitty-gritty of this um, on this studio vlog you're gonna see a lot of uh, broken pieces of like 10 minutes I have here and there but that's really a good representation of what I go through it's really important for me that I take advantage of this time that I might have late at, um, in the evening or early in the mornings before I go to work um, they do add up and make a difference as you can see over here I'm just organizing my washi tapes who doesn't love a good clip of that and I'm taking my sweet time with some relaxing organization because it really sets the tone of my space and it's very important for me that it's a little bit tidy at least. I'm making my way up because I was working on a gouache piece as you can see by my palette and um, every time I paint I make a mess basically. My little guy is about to wake up from a nap, so I might need to interrupt this recording, but for now I'm enjoying this time. I'm just sitting with my cup of tea and relaxing while I'll edit this vlog. I'm probably disregarding a couple of duties I should be doing right now, but it's good for my soul to be doing this type of creative things outside of doing stickers or painting new things or feeling pressure to create a new painting and show it online I really do feel like creating videos is outside of my comfort zone because I literally do not know what I'm doing and <laughs> I hope you enjoy that um, but yeah it's um, late April 2021 um, we are in terms of the world we are about to get a glimpse of some freedom back but let's see if that's it for the pandemic or not who knows um, throughout these clips I'm just gonna basically show you like I was saying show you um, some clips I had over the course of maybe two months because guys this is really what happens when you're a mom you are so busy with everything you need to do for the family and for your kids and for yourself that you don't have like two hours every day to work on your little shop so yeah I'm setting the tone for a good um, week ahead here I was organizing I believe this was on a Sunday and I was about done with the state of my studio I do feel like when it's really messy I I don't um, I'm not as productive as I could be if everything was tidy because I look at a messy place and I think oh my gosh I need to tidy this up before I can start working so it's not even worth it and end up not doing anything with it so that's basically what I was doing here I do think I did not have the time on that same day <laughs> to continue so that's why this is another day this um, type of thing I do um, on the weekends because like I said I work full-time and I also study um, during the week because I'm studying for a big big exam uh, for my pharmacist license in the US um, and yeah this type of more intricate intricate work for the shop I do on the weekends um, there's no way I do it during the week because well I would love to honestly but 
um, I have other stuff to do even um, though I'd prefer <laughs> doing um, shop work but anyways I digress here I'm doing my inventory I did a shop update um, early April or maybe even late March um, as I was um, trying to do a little birthday sale my birthday is in March so I wanted to do a little birthday sale and do something different this time I do feel like my style is changing quite a bit oh actually over here I have some um, functional stickers for planners but those are not ready yet I think those will take me a couple of tries before I can release them but anyways yeah I released um, two sticker packs this is the Monastera one you're seeing here I released that sticker pack and also um, some abstract um, paintings with some florals in them this is the one but you can't really see it in detail I'll try to include a little uh, picture of them but yeah I was basically taking inventory because I do feel like I need to be more organized um, I find myself sometimes selling things that I am out of stock thankfully it's really easy for me to be in stock because I just have to print it and cut it at home so it's not a big deal but it's still a little bit stressful so this time around I decided I needed to be a little bit more organized also as a side note I was feeling really a little bit burnt out from work and from studying so I also decided to take this big weekend off where I would only do shop work and I'm not even talking about uh, creative work you guys I was literally just wanting to have some time to dedicate to my shop because it's been a while since I've done that and it was kind of bothering me <laughs> so I decided um, if I had time I would paint but also my focus would be do this kind of um, background work that I do enjoy a lot um, and I actually miss doing uh, it's one of those things I really don't find the time for enough but anyways, I was doing a bunch of cutting and rearranging and finding new packaging styles. Um, I find my packaging pretty min minimalist. I have this um, cute burgundy uh, background for the sticker packs and then I put them in a little plastic sleeve and I just um, stick a little logotype sticker in them. Um, and that's pretty much it. I was doing the backing cards to have at least like eight sticker packs ready to go. And yeah, I have fun with this type of monotonous work because it clears my mind so much. And then um, I finished packing the monasteras, I finished packing the minimalist. Uh, florals or greeneries and then I think I moved on um, to the sticker sheets that you can see in the back I released two colors um, all together because I didn't have time to release the winter palette um, over Christmas I had the idea that I would release them in the New Year's in January but it was really really impossible and hard um, to find the time to do it so I just decided to release two colors in the same listing um, let's see how that will work out I usually do one listing per color but this time around I decided to try something else another thing I wanted to touch upon was um, that as a mother sometimes um, I do this type of work when my son is here in my studio this is what was happening right here you might hear him in the background he's fascinated by the washing machine that is really close to my studio so I think that was either running or it was open and he wanted to go in there <laughs> and put some clothes in there. It's actually helpful because it keeps me 
a little bit freer, let's say, and keeps him busy for a while, <laughs> at least for five minutes while he's fascinated by it. And this kind of mundane work is really easy to do when he's awake because um, I don't need a lot of brain power. I want this sticker I needed a lot of fixing, it, it seems. I try not to show his face online. Um, I try really hard, by the way, so I might have to clean up some clips over here. <laughs> But yeah, we have fun. He loves the little pens and pencils and it's fun. He hangs around for at least 20 minutes before he is over with it. <laughs> but yeah, on this day, um, what was I saying? I was saying something else before. Um, I think I was thinking about how my style is changing. And I have a hard time giving up on things, like I really like this type of more minimalist and calm style of um, just blobs of ink and then some um, tracing. And I'm having a hard time moving away from that. I, I mean, I don't think I need to give those up. I just think that my brand is not as um, on point because when you look at my like Instagram feed you don't see just one particular style like you don't necessarily look at it and see oh she does this style that I identify myself with so much that I must stay and follow and I'm more of the oh she has so many things going on I like this but it's not my vibe or oh I really like this style but this is not just what she does she does a bunch of other stuff that I'm not interested in so I'm not gonna stay this is more of a um, deep conversation about how social media kind of pressures us pressure pressures us bleh, on numbers and uh, focusing on how many followers or likes I do know that that does not define me but at the end of the day that brings sales and sustainability for business so it is important to think on those things but as I was saying I have at least two or three maybe three different lines of work um, that I don't want to part with so I think this year in the beginning of the year, I really wanted to find my style, and I still do. But I'm also guessing, I'm guessing I'm, I guess I am allowing myself to just explore different um, avenues with my style. That's, that's definitely what I want to do. Actually, I even have a some clips here about a new sticker sheet that I haven't released yet and I don't even know if I will have time for it. It's for spring which is almost over, well not quite, we're still in April but I don't think I will have time in the meantime. Anyway, I'm speaking so much, I think you guys are probably done with hearing my voice so I'll just leave a little clip here with just some chill music and I hope you enjoy the rest of the vlog and I might be back with some goodbye greetings who knows thank you so much if you've made it this far and if you have heard my ramblings please let me know and leave a comment below if you have any tips or if you identify with what I'm sharing I'm sure I'm not alone it would be really nice to know that I'm not alone <laughs> in this um, I'd love to hear from you guys and Thank you so much for being here. Bye-bye.
Hello, I'm back. It's been a good weekend. I've been chilling around and doing house chores and now I'm just chilling in my living room. This is a new style I'm now embarking on and I'm so happy with it. I have a sticker pack coming up that includes this little strawberry friend. Again, I'm not sure when I will be able to release it, but it's in the works. And I also have a fun um, product coming up with them. And it's five different beverage beverages um, all combined into a fun little product. You probably can guess if you try hard. <laughs> um, but again i'm not sure when they will be out but i'm working hard on it guys i promise <laughs> goodbye and have fun i hope you have a good week ahead it's currently sunday which you can probably notice by my very low energy voice um but yeah it's now sunday and i'm just getting ready to prepare for another busy week ahead i hope you have a great one i hope you've enjoyed this vlog if you made it this far thank you so so much i really appreciate it and hit the thumbs up and leave a little comment below if you fancy it really helps my channel grow and that's it guys happy art making happy beverage drinking happy week bye bye